Hello everybody, Flamin' Shark back with another video, and today we're going to be reacting to Season 2, Episode 13, or uh, Part 2, Episode 3 of Season 2 of The Owl House. Uh, I'm really excited for this, should be a lot of fun, episode is called... Any sport in a storm. Interesting. So we, um, we've we done a sports episode before. I believe that was in season one. Um, sounds like we're doing another sports episode, which could be quite interesting. Last time we did a double reaction because, you know, I would trip and stuff. Also, this video, a little late, going out on Wednesday instead of Monday. Next week, for sure, it's going out on Monday. It'll also be the only video going out on Monday, so instead of being at this late time of 4 p.m. PST, it'll be at the normal upload time of noon PST because it will not be sharing the day with AOT since AOT Season 4 Part 2 is over, so it'll just be um, the Owl House next Monday. So, yeah. It'll, so it'll be four hours earlier as far as, like, when in the day it'll come out, assuming I don't have any issues with it. But, yeah... I'm definitely looking forward to this. This should be a lot of fun. I'm definitely excited to see what this episode has in store. I thought the last two episodes were great. They were both, they really just was a great start to the second half of season two. Uh, we got the stuff with Rain and Ida. We got the stuff, I I'm going to be flipping around between the two episodes, but we got the stuff with Ida and her dad. Uh, Del, oh, I think it was, I think it's Del. Pretty sure it's Del. Something, it's something uh, simple like that. Um, but we got various Ida stuff in both episodes that were really good. Uh, in episode 12, we got stuff with Philip and with um, Lily and Luce that was really cool. In episode 11, we got the stuff with uh, Amity and Luce that was really cool. Uh, we had a little interaction between Willow and Amity that was really cool. So just a lot of stuff all around. I think I felt like most of the characters got a chance to shine. Um, Kikimura also was doing things, which was really fun. A lot of stuff all around. Um, characters they didn't really spot, we got to see Belos' face. Um, characters that they haven't really spotlighted yet in Season 2 Part 2, I would say Gus, Hunter, um, those are two big ones that really haven't done anything. I mean, again, it's only been two episodes, but, um... I feel like they spotlighted most of the relevant people. I guess Willow hasn't been spotlighted, but she did have a little. Um, she did have a little appearance in the uh, in the last set. But uh, I'm really excited for this. This is a single episode outhouse reaction, though, so it'll probably be a pretty short video, unless I have it. Well, I mean, even if I have a time to say, it'll obviously be a sub one hour video, very short video, relatively speaking. But um, Hopefully you guys are enjoying it. I mean, the plan is to do these uh, one episode reactions to the Owl House um, on Mondays moving forward if I don't. But, uh, you know, I, I seem to sometimes find ways to end up not posting them on the day that I want to post them. So there is that. But we are jumping in to season two, episode 13. Let's have some fun. All right. Season 2, episode 13 of The Owl House will commence in 3, 2, 1, and play. Going to the castle right away. We're we going to Bellos or one of Bellos? Ah, Hunter. Well, there he is. Yeah, it does look good as new. And there's your uh, talisman. And I have no idea what I'm doing. Hello. My duties are keeping me busy. I entrust you to lead the Covenants today. Consider this a test. Hmm. Good. You're all here. We can get started. Hey, where are you? <laughs> and Set, there's wait. Raid. And there's, here. there's our girl who is terrifying. Damn. Yeah. Our good old plant girl is kind of the one Darius, that's really running everyone. things around. Why is everyone leaving? We're scheduled to have a recruitment meeting. <sighs> Good morning to you too, little prince. We decided to reschedule the meeting, so go play arts and crafts, or whatever it is you do. Oh, looks like you've already started. <laughs> this is impressively bad. Wait, wow. is this the old Golden Guard sigil? Of course it is! And this is no way to treat the Emperor's- Nephew? I knew your predecessor. 
He was my mentor. One of the strongest witches I've ever known. Ooh. But you, hmm. But Bella says I don't need magic to serve the covenant. And I say you don't deserve to wear that patch. Damn. Wait, what should I do? How do I earn it? Oh, sweet mother of titans. I I don't know. Sweet Find new recruits titans, for the Emperor's Coven. The best and the brightest witches in all the land. Ah. Then maybe you can get this back. I can think That's of a few. You. Of course you will. You're very good at doing exactly what you're told. He's not wrong, to be honest, Hunter. I mean, you're not completely obedient, but... You know. Let's get it. Alright, any sport in a storm. Hey! Oh my god, really? We're getting Willow Spotlight and... Wow. What the fuck? Something I can be good at. Something I want to be good at. Well, she's working out. Just to be kidding. I'm on my way to becoming the witch I want to be. I mean, I know she's training her plant powers, but... I can't wait for her to have a fight one-on-one -on -one with a certain plant girl. I have the Liger, girl. Knock him I have the Liger, wow. Wow, it's Club Fair with no E. It's just F-A-I-R. What the fuck? Yeah, plant magic's kind of OP, I'm not gonna lie. That's why we try to it's very versatile. Lockers. So, ready for the club fair, Willow? May Damn, the way she, like, touched her hair me? was very cute. Club. What the fuck? Thanks, but That's I'm funny. interested in something with a little more drama. Flare and face paint. I'm so Based? excited to hear the next words out of your mouth. Flyer Derby! Oh, oh my god! god. <laughs> Derby! But, like, oh, Hogwarts no Derby. The okay, that was pretty lame, actually. Ever since our rugby match, I've been playing it at home. Today, I'm starting Hexide's first Flyer Derby team. Yeah! Nice. I mean, that was cool. Sure. Are you cruising for a bruising? I don't know, it didn't look... with us to a world of magic unlike any other! Well, a bit like this world, except toned down for ages 6 to 11. Nice. Why isn't anyone interested? The art doesn't do it any favors. Wow. Not judging a book by its cover is a baby rule even babies know. Nice. Plus, you don't read Azura for the art. There's so much magic in the words. Twice have I tarried at Tanabrak, yet ere have I kept <laughs> my troth to thee, Azura. Wow. Hey, the prose can be ornate, but it's well, also I mean, so the so is emotions. so is fucking the Shakespeare's magic system. The convoluted the magic of the system. Pages. Wow. Los, <sighs> I heard that. <sighs> Spill it, Hermosa. The author of Azura is having a signing this afternoon. Hey, book let's go. Huh? You are much less excited than I imagined. Uh, excuse me, I'm Wait, still here. Wait, because it's I'm written in the human world? The author is human. No, she's not. She's from the demon realm. How do you think I got my books? How do you think, you think I, got I got my books? Whoa, hey! See? Human. Oh my god! Of Travel between realms? And, and they look familiar, too. You guys are cute! Don't they look familiar? They are cute. But the you know look at all these potential recruits. You do have more friends, but they're probably sure they're, they're I've shittier never friends. Spoke into which is my age. What the fuck? Are probably into the same things as me, like authority, rules. Wow. Classmate, ignore the fact that we've never met. What if I told you all your dreams could come true, and you just have to leave your home, friends, and family forever? Uh... That sounds very um. If, if you were older, I would say that sounds very cool. pedophilic. Not as cool as the Emperor's Coven. I hear you get to sleep in till 6 a.m. Banish card, nice. You! How would you like to rise to the top by joining the Emperor's Coven? Eh, not interested. Nice. I mean, do I want to study different kinds of magic? Heck yes! But why is joining the Emperor's Coven my only option? When I get older, I'm gonna give this system a long overdue update. Damn. What are you talking about? <gasps> it's okay, Petals. No, you didn't mean it. The Griffin. No, 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 Jesus no, 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 Christ, that is a Griffin that is going to kick your ass. 
club is approved, we'll travel all across the aisles and rock and Damn. outfits and work Those two team. girls look badass. Professor Homunculus? I'm overseeing club approvals this year, and I just don't think Flyer Derby is worth investing in. Just because it's not as well known as Grudge Beat doesn't mean. You misunderstand me. I'm shutting it down unless you step down as captain. I just don't think quitters make good leaders. Damn! Just mad that she dropped her class. Give her a chance. Okay. Put together a team for a friendly game of Flyer Derby after school. If you can lead your team to victory, maybe I'll approve your club. Well, wow, that's such a bullshit argument because he just said maybe <sighs> even if you well. win. Don't let him beat you. I mean, you if you impress him, but Amity and Luce are busy. He remembers his love of Flyer Derby. He'll do it, of course. Calm down, oh my God, Hunter! Hey. Yo, it's literally a Hunter and Willow episode when I said that those two hadn't had much, really any focus yet. I mean, I guess Gus was the other. Actually, I said before Willow. Damn. Flyer Derby team? Nice. This is Gus Porter, and I'm Willow Park, future captain of Hexide's first Flyer Derby team. Nice to meet you. Stop shaking him, Jesus. Was amazing. You're a new student, right? Yeah. Weird. We've never seen you around. What's Awkward. Your name? Uh, Caleb. 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 Jasper Blood Williams. Caleb. Yeah, I just transferred from... Jasper Blood Williams. Griffin side. The toes? But I'm not here to play the toes. To or whatever that is. I have my own mission. Okay. At least take a pamphlet. The best and brightest. Wait! Do you really think your club will attract the best and the brightest? Absolutely! Flyer Derby's not for the fate witch. Then maybe I will give it a try. Really? But okay, how do we evaluate others? A witch's duel? A maze full of traps? Oh, leave everyone at the top of a mountain and see who makes it back to the <laughs> <laughs> King of the Hill Classic. slash uh, Hunger Games. I don't have time for all that, but you can help by attracting people with your six sky skills. Oh, hmm. I think he oh, could attract people with sick. other people. Hey, I don't know what kind he of is, mission you're on. He is essentially a, literally a teen. She's Arthur really up. looking forward to making this team a thing. Don't mess this up for her. Damn, Gus. I can't that was like never really fucking this serious. I always thought Mildred Featherwild sounded too delightful to be a real name. Do you think she has her own portal? <gasps> Do you think she's related to that human guy, Philip? What if the author is Ida? She's been keeping it secret this whole time. Oh my god. It, it's not quite Ida. Okay, these theories are a little unrealistic. It's obviously your mother as a teenager sent for what? time to train you in the ways of witchcraft. What the fuck? Whatever it is, we're going to find out soon. <laughs> Nice. <laughs> Students of Hexide. Got a palisman? It's interesting. I think the drills, these chills, I'm interested in the A plot and the B well, plot, but I think I'm slightly more interested you. in the B plot with Amity and Luce. I really wanted to see more of how well um Man, Willow great. can fly. With him, I think we can really get our derby team approved. This girl will be a perfect candidate for the Emperor's Cup. Oh my god. <laughs> like her, we're set. Hey, come on down! To introduce you to the best and the brightest of uh, Hexide. Well, Look, Puddles, it's the friend you made before. Ah, no, Damn, no, Puddles no, really wants to murder. Mm. Let's try this one more time. Lovely. Just a few months ago, I'd be considered the weak link on any team, but now I'm leading one. Yeah. <laughs> okay, girl, don't let the power get you. You and Caleb. Are the only inch damn? He's already like fuck Caleb. this. Where are you going? The field is this way. You said you'd find the best witches for this team, but them? They're pathetic. You damn. just met them. Give them a chance. Well, where I come from, even chances have to be earned. Damn. Especially if you're considered half a witch like me. Sorry, Captain. Good luck with your match. Damn. What the fuck? What the fuck? What the hell? Okay, that was rude. I'm sorry. I mean, he was being sorry, rude, but she was being right ruder. Been playing Grudge Me for so long, I needed to catch up on the latest Flyer Derby streets. Wow, okay, fair enough. Those look complicated. They 
R. Nice. Whew. Okay, finally. Got Puddles down for her nap. Nice, nice. Now Clean I'm up. only scarred emotionally. <laughs> No, I said of course, at Gus, damn, okay. Okay, that was a little, the Gus one's a bit silly. I thought you couldn't fly. So I can't fly like everyone else. But my way's more fun. Nice. Oh, that's uh, cool, I guess. Oh, nice. I said it was cool. Yes. And of course there's Willow. He's a natural speed demon. Scar is a strategic wizard. And Viney's the best healer in school. And at one point or another, we've all been misjudged. Damn, Savage. Still think we're pathetic? Nice. Good. Lesson! Jesus Christ. That made no sense, but let's go. I don't know. I've never found another store that sold those books. You were so close. I think that's her. That's the author. Mildred. Oh, Featherwile? Oh, maybe that's not who I thought it was. This is why I don't say things out loud. <laughs> it's me. What the? How did you get this number? Doesn't nice. matter. I found some incredible recruits in Hexai. I'm earning my place, just like you told me. Uh, of course you are. I just wanted you to leave me alone. What was that? Caleb! Waiting on you, buddy. I gotta go. But you'll meet them soon. Yeah, a little, little, little. Thanks for asking me to join, guys. I think we're gonna have a... <gasps> Jerbo? What the fuck? Fun afternoon. Wow. Oh, we gotta do Ooh, I like that star. The star, Let's um... See what you can do. Face paint? I don't know, I wanna call it makeup, but it's... Face paint, same thing, I guess, when you think about it. I guess face paint's more, has more of a badass undertone, and makeup's more of, like, a pretty undertone. That was pretty oh, cool. That was amazing. <laughs> nice making friends. Okay. The <laughs> damn that sound effect. Oh my god, not even looking. And now they're gonna make out, right? She's right there! Can't you see? Damn! That was sick! Damn, sick. Oh shit. What the fuck, bro? Nice teamwork. If she'd save herself, and he can, he can finish it. Damn. And that GG, I assume. Yep. Ah, it's like the Gatorade bath. <laughs> May I please have your team name? Shoot, we never thought of a name. The Emerald Entrails. You know, because we're green, and there's more to us than you think. Entrails, yes, entrails, yes. Entrails, I like the entrails, Emerald part, entrails, but Entrails, I don't know about that. We're number one. Nice. I can't believe I almost bailed on you guys. Today was amazing. Thanks for giving me another shot. Always nice making a new friend. I had an opening for one. <gasps> Damn! Yeah, fuck. yeah, I shouldn't have been so suspicious. No, you actually should. We forget shouldn't. all about that when we play next time, as a part of the Emperor's Coven. Wow. What? <laughs> it isn't Caleb? It's Hunter, and I'm the Emperor's right-hand man, the Golden Guard. <sighs> you can't be serious. You're not the one Luz told us about, right? Yes, I am. Nice! Nice! That transition! look cooler with the cloak, but I don't have it at the moment. Long story. Holy shit. <gasps> what the fuck? That was cool. Hello there, Scouts. I didn't give you orders to come here. Darius sent us to collect your recruits. Ah, okay. Very good. Then there won't be any delay in branding you with Coven Sigils and taking you away from your friends and family forever. <laughs> nice! <laughs> Yay! Okay. Jesus, they actually. I'm sorry about this whole cell thing, but did you really have to punch Steve, Scara? Aww. Emotions are running high. Yeah. Nice pack for Steve. Nice pack for oh, Steve. Okay. Steve's chill. You're joining the best coven there is. You can keep all your magic. You get free room and board. You can even play flyer derby on your day off. Well, this year's day has already passed, but next year's only 52 weeks away. Nice. Care. None of us want this. You will eventually. Trust me. I'm your friend now. 
friends don't stab each other in the yeah, back. Yeah, friends don't force sure people do. into... The coven heads do it all the time back in the castle. Wow. Captain, you're on my side, right? Not friends. I thought I could be good at this. But we're here because I made a bad call. I'm just half a witch willow. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, I did it! I found recruits! Yep, and you're making me work on my day off. Take this and quit bugging me. Is Darius? Is Darius a fucking face? I can wear this proudly now. Is Darius? Right? Can you? Oh, Darius is a good castle. guy, isn't he? Golden Guard. Oh my god, Darius is gonna save them, isn't he? I do not envy those kids, man. They just have to go through basic training before becoming scouts. It's not too bad. Dude, do you even remember what we had to do? The duels. The mazes with the traps. That time we were left alone on a mountain? Hey, <laughs> yeah. Classic. And of course, Bellus likes to collect everyone's palace men. Oh, Jesus Christ. <sighs> Steve is beginning to regret his choices. Yikes. Steve is my new favorite character, I think by the way. Too. Yeah, I bet. Yeah, now I'm unsure actually as to who this person is. Jesus Christ! Maybe it's Kikimura, and her only way to express herself is through fiction. Maybe it's another shape-shifting basilisk trying to write their story no. through metaphor. Oh my god! Tanella Nosa? She's had a name this whole time! <laughs> Holy shit! Sorry, boss. The jig is up. <gasps> oh my god. Tables? Edited a few more of those author photos, boss. Some of my finest work. <gasps> Loose? <laughs> Metholomew! Oh I'll my god. Down. Human garbage is constantly leaking into our water. And about a year ago, I found this box of books washed up on the shore. I've been trying to make a snail of it ever since, but no one's buying! Wait, I'm still getting paid for this, right? Not so not it is a human, um... According to the owner of the book nook, he's only ever had one customer purchase from this... Amity. Series. I... I didn't know. I swear! This is the worst scam I've ever run! Wow. So the author is human after all. Oh! Were you expecting some dramatic discovery? <laughs> no, but hey, aw, at least at least we at least we appreciate it. Maybe you'll get to meet her if you ever get back to your world, Luz. Damn, that's like that. I, I love those type of powers. Chilly Lily, oh my god. Mute. Got a little nope. social media or whatever they call it. You're gonna need to be a little more clever than that. Darius! Now! Mm. <gasps> An illusion. Land the ship! Wait! Damn! Damn! Land the ship! That was like really fast! What the hell? That whole sequence is like way too, way like. There was like no drama really there. Think you could get away with endangering a coven head. Do you have any idea what I'm capable of? My bad. But Willow's pretty badass, the others aren't too bad. Maybe together they have a chance. Jesus Christ. Wait! Out of my way, little prince. No! I was mistaken. These four are insolent agitators who aren't fit for the Emperor's Coven. And I'm unfit to wear the sigil of the Golden Guard. You can go. Please, Captain. Let's move, team. We need to find a replacement. Damn. After all, it'll be 52 weeks before Caleb's next day off. Damn. You befriended them, and then you disobeyed me to protect them? I'm impressed. Yep. I had you all wrong. Huh? You're what, 16? It's about time you made connections outside the castle. <laughs> I was just gonna drop them off at Hexide. We have more than enough recruits, in my opinion. Are you gonna tell Bellus about this? Are you going to tell him about your secret palisman? 
Magic or not? Nice. I think you'll make your predecessors proud. Hey! 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 He's earned in respect! Yo! But you could still use a sewing lesson. Yeah. Or like 12, so, maybe? Are you upset? Nah. The Zora's author may be a human, but I'm human too. I can't speak. I don't know Sometimes how to sew. Sometimes be reminded that you don't need to be a powerful ancient witch to make something special. Well, I had fun coming up with those theories. They were like our own stories. Aww. What if the Azora Book Club was also a writing club? What would be our first writing book? Doki, Doki! How about the mystery of <gasps> what they were up to all night? Did he just make an account? Wow, he is a slow typer. <laughs> He's worse than my dad. Oh, hey guys. I am really digging those outfits. Yeah. So there are vibes, especially he Willows. Miss anything? Actually, all of them. Actually, win is girl the on the Emerald right, especially. Entrails. Emerald and oh my god! Ooh, let me see, let me see. <gasps> what? Yeah, there's a lot to talk about about that one, and they go to the end of the episode, of course. Classic. Yeah, one of these is not like the others. Oh man, that's such a cool shot. Holy shit. And yeah, the boy Hunter being cool as fuck. And then yeah, I like how it kind of gets like progressively sadder and more depressing. It feels like with each shot, even though that shot's happy at the end. But so that was maybe coincidental, but still cool. Alrighty, that was season two, episode thirteen of the Owl House. And, uh, yeah, that was really good. That was a Hunter episode, Willow episode, both of them. We also got a B-plot with Luce and Amity, which, you know, Lumity, that's cool. I'm always down for the, uh, the girls hanging out, having a, you know, not a date, but hanging out, being cute, and all that shit. Um, and related to the whole Azura stuff, because they're both nerds. Good episode, though. Good episode. Definitely enjoyed it. Um, I think all three of these episodes have been really good so far, and I'm definitely excited for uh, the next episode, which will be in less than a week. A couple days, actually, it'll come out. I'll either watch it Saturday or Sunday. Probably Sunday, but um, you guys will see my reaction on Monday. I, I promise this time, like, for sure, like, 95% sure it's going to come out on Monday. I'm, like, pretty confident about that, but... Um, I, I really think that we'll, uh, we'll be, we'll start to get back to some semblance of normality on the channel again, starting, uh, with, uh, these, with this, this video and the AOT video. Uh, but yeah, that, that was a really, really fun episode. I think we had a really good time with that one. I really enjoyed, um, seeing Hunter's character develop more, becoming more of a, of a softy, so to speak. And, uh, his eventual face turn, full-blown face turn, and just turning on Bellos is going to be quite the moment that I'm really appreciative of. And it's nice to see they're really they're starting to build up the Coven Heads. Um, in the last couple episodes, we've gotten to really learn more about multiple Coven Heads, and of course, there's also Rain, who was who got more focus recently. So we're um, really building up the Coven Heads for whatever big conflicts are coming later in this season or potentially in the um in the final the final ep i don't know what to call them episode specials or whatever after whatever the case may be i really like how this is all uh coming together and i'm really enjoying these uh these quite a bit so i'm having a good time hopefully you guys you guys are too this has been really great and i'm really excited to be doing this this now officially mondays or owl house mondays moving forward so now it's like Nice and easy, at least for the time being. We have Owl House Mondays, and I'm really excited for them, and there's nothing weird about it. That's just what we're going to be posting um, on Mondays moving forward. So uh, I'm excited, and I hope you guys are too. They should these, uh, these videos should be a lot of fun. I'm definitely looking forward to where the story goes. It is kind of weird to think of how close we really are to the end. Um, you know, and I think each episode is going... It, it's very purposeful. You feel it. Every episode feels like it's achieving a goal. Every episode feels like it's playing a purpose to the grand story. You know, I think the character development with Willow, with Hunter in this episode, it was very important. The Especially Hunter, but Willow's as well. You know, she's not half a witch Willow, and she needs to grow out of ever thinking like that. 
because she's better than that and she needs to know that. Well, we know that, but it's important for her to know that. And we also, like I said, got a little bit more on Covenheads. We we got um, Darius. Uh, we got to learn about him and what his deal is. So that's pretty cool. So lots of fun stuff all around. I really like this episode. I'm really high on this season in general. I think season two of The Owl House has been fantastic. Thought season one was very cool. It was a good show. I think season, like I think, I feel like season one was good. Season two has been great. That's an easy way to put it. Season one was good. Season two has been great. Really enjoying uh, season two of the Owl House, both the uh, first half as well as the last three episodes. So uh, yeah, I'm I'm really excited to keep moving forward with this series. Very excited to see where we go uh, with this, and I'm I'm really looking forward to it. So I'm sure I'm hoping to. Uh, give you guys some uh, more great Owl House content on Mondays moving forward. And hopefully I can actually live up to giving you guys the videos on Mondays, uh, which I think I will. Like I said, I think I'm, I think this is where I'm out of the funk and I think I'm going to start, you know, getting recordings done um, d daily, close to daily, whatever, and, and getting, getting videos up every day or close to it as well. So uh, we should be good to go. We should be good to go to start posting Owl House on Mondays moving forward. But, uh, yeah, that's pretty much all I have to say. I don't have a ton to say about this. This this episode, like I said, it was a great character building episode, but there wasn't really much like crazy plot development. So a pretty minimal discussion beyond what I already talked about in the commentary on the episode itself. So I'm going to leave it there. So uh, yeah, um, if you guys want to support the channel, you can check out my Patreon down below in the description. Discord server is also down there as well. And without any further ado, it is time for me to bid you adieu. Flame and Shark signing out. Hope you guys have a wonderful, fantastical day. And I'll see you next time with another video. Thanks for watching. Peace.